Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Portville 2. I hear you knocking, but you can't come in. Well, maybe you can now. Yeah. Hey, we're over here, me and Debbie's over here in Portville too. So we couldn't get this door open. The ceiling was collapsed on it. It was actually supposed to open going inward. And I just kind of wanted to check out the old house a little bit. Debbie was recording. I don't want the whole house to fall, at least not yet, because there's a few things I'm trying to save. Boy, I look like that could be dangerous. One of them being that door right there. Oh! Just fell right on my head. Oh, it's only insulation. Debbie didn't tell me. So I was hoping to get these couple of these mattresses out of here, take them down to the road. And I want to save these windows here. But yeah, I want to see if I can re repurpose that door there. So yeah, I'm going to come back today, or a little bit here. See if I can hook a chain and get a couple of these mattresses out of there and get them down to the garbage. I figure I take a little bit of stuff out every week. Yeah, I was hoping that was real red brick, but it's wallpaper. So I'm trying to see these windows without breaking them and this door and the frame and everything because I'll reuse that. That thing is old. Yeah, nasty. I was going to try to pull them windows out. I hooked on it with a chain, gave it a couple pulls and act like this whole wall wanted to fall down, but... Yeah, well, I don't want to get it all down at once. I want to just kind of, maybe this little section. This thing is trying to save that door, but this, this ceiling is trying to collapse. It's got a bunch of mud and leaves and everything, and I can hear it and see it moving. Maybe a good rainstorm, that'll fall. Hopefully that door don't get broke before I get it out of there. upstairs steps there that whole ceiling is collapsing too in there but yeah I want to reclaim that if I can anyway I'm gonna at least get one of these mattresses out of here today yeah that door it's actually got the I think it's a little bit tin that'll go in the tin pile Got insulation all down my neck. Thank you, Debbie. You're Debbie said that was gross. We're just going to take a stroll up here. Now, this is where Don come from originally. I think I, well, I know I said that before. And we brought him back home, but he, he thinks he owns the place already. He's pretty much trying to take everything over. Yeah, we didn't do very good at all on our yard sale. We didn't have nearly the people we have. Uh, what do we make, about 50 bucks? Yeah, 58. $58 for three days. Got a couple people that's supposed to come back, but sometimes that happens. 
Well, usually we make a lot more than that, but it's just the last couple of years that just nobody's buying this kind of stuff. Well, there's Don. He's back over here working hard as usual. Like this is my home. So he used to be out here camel in the woods and chase the hunters off the property. But now he's styling. Hey Don, you glad to be home? That's what I thought. I thought you appreciate. Look at that smile on his face. Carhartt. What what kind of wardrobe is that? Why well, he's styling? He's making a fashion statement. He threw away his leather goods, at least for today. He looks like he could use some a wire wheel again or something. Yeah, anyway, they're done. Just going to set out here for who knows how long, maybe a couple, three or four years, for all we know. But sometimes he'll get up and move around a little bit. Yeah, just thought we'd do a, a video. We've been moving some stuff over here, just little things here and there. Take a walk back out and look at this old building. I don't know what all is in there. You can't really get in there safely. It's it's uh, definitely a little tricky. But actually there's some really good, probably 16, 18 foot 2 by 6s in there if a guy can get them out of there. They're kind of hard to re-nail to when they're that old. But I've used them before, drilled into them. I think there's enough to build another garage if I wanted to. We got a little bit of junk here and there. We're going to get a bunch of stuff together and bring our dump truck over and load up some more tin and with what we got on there, I'm not sure we might dump what we got on there and then just load it again. Bring the firewood over, it's blocking my garage, I'll go up. I'm gonna try, Debbie, can you on? See if you can unhook that door and I'll see if I can hook onto the map for us. Okay. Throw that chain over here, will you, Debbie? Yep. Just kind of, if I can reach the map for us with it. Oh, yeah, well, I guess that'll work. Oh, That's all right. We've got to unhook that other one. We're going to need yeah. to. She's standing on the other end of this. You ain't doing that on purpose, are you, Debbie? No. So I don't want to rip this building down, so I'm just going to hook to this corner and I hope enough of it holds. Something will snag on there. See if I can back up here. Alright, I'm going to put you on pause for a second. <laughs> 